All right, if you're ready to shop for some good deals, time to mark your calendars. July 12th and 13th have been announced as Amazon Prime Days. The company announced the dates Thursday, saying the big sale will kick off at 3 a.m. and run for 48 hours in multiple countries, including Poland and Sweden now for the first time. You'll be able to save on electronics, toys, things for the house, clothes, a ton of other stuff. It's a big deal for deal hunters, and Amazon says it's a way to build loyalty with folks who have Prime and get new people to sign up. During last year's Prime Day, online spending topped more than $11 billion. That's more than 6% over 2020. Hey, Sunday's the big day for Pops. You know, the old man, dear old dad. Plenty of restaurants offering deals on Sunday. Applebee's has $10 bonus cards for each $50 bought. Cracker Barrel has digital bonus cards for dad on some home cooking. Ruth's Chris Steakhouse has dad brunch from 11 to 3. Even the Cheesecake Factory giving you 25 bucks for each $100. Or maybe you can just change dad's routine up with a summer outing. Consumers are going to be spending $20 billion on Sunday. And 76% of Americans celebrate Father's Day, according to the National Retail Federation. Hey, scientists believe the Hubble telescope has detected a black hole right in our own backyard. Of course, that's speaking in astronomy terms. It's actually about 5,000 light years away in a spiral arm of our Milky Way, known as Carina Sagittarius, the black hole, might look similar to what you're seeing. That's actually an artist's impression of it. Scientists identified it when Hubble observed deflected starlight bent by the collapsed star's massive gravitational pull. Researchers believe this black hole is in motion, and they think there are about 100 million more free-floating black holes moving around our galaxy. But the newest discovery does help astronomers estimate that the closest one could be about 80 light years away. Hey, Oreo is at it again. They are adding a flavorful twist to its cookies. Oh, this looks good. The cookie company announced on TikTok the release of the Neapolitan sandwich cookies. Of course, it has the three flavors you'd find in Neapolitan, a layer of strawberry, chocolate, and vanilla flavored Oreo cream in between the sandwich cookies. And those cookies aren't your traditional brown or chocolate cookies. They're waffle cone cookies. Oh, Oreo says that these special sweets will be available nationwide next month.